Hi guys, I'm delighted to have you join me today on a quest to uncover the secrets of a formidable predator that reigned supreme over the seas more than 360 million years ago. Prepare to be mesmerized by Duncleosteus, an ancient giant that possessed a ferocity and resilience in match in the annals of history. To truly appreciate the magnitude of Duncleosteus, we must first journey back in time to the late Devonian era, a pivotal period in Earth's history. The late Devonian, which spanned from approximately 380 to 360 million years ago, was a time of remarkable change and innovation, particularly in the realm of marine life. The Devonian period, often referred to as the Age of Fishes, witnessed a flourishing of diverse marine ecosystems. This era was characterized by extensive shallow seas, rich in nutrients and teeming with life. It was a golden age for marine creatures, a time of rapid diversification and evolutionary experimentation. The Devonian oceans were home to an incredible array of organisms, ranging from ancient armored fish is to early sharks and even primitive plants. This period saw the rise of jawed fishes, the predecessors of modern-day vertebrates, marking a significant milestone in the evolutionary history of marine life. These ancient seas were vastly different from the oceans we know today. The climate during the late Devonian was relatively warm, and the continents were positioned differently, forming a supercontinent called Gondwan. Shallow tropical seas covered vast expanses, fostering diverse ecosystems and providing abundant food sources for the inhabitants. The Devonian oceans were a realm of both opportunity and danger. While this era witnessed the emergence of remarkable marine predators like Duncleosteus, it also hosted a variety of other fascinating creatures, each adapted to their own unique ecological niches. From ammonites to trilobites, the Devonian oceans were a vibrant tapestry of life and evolutionary innovation. As we plunge into the realm of Duncleosteus, we are met with a creature of colossal proportions. This ancient giant, which roamed the Devonian seas, reached lengths of up to 33 feet 10 meters, making it one of the largest predators of its time. Its sheer size alone would have struck fear into the hearts of any unfortunate prey. One of the most striking features of Duncleosteus is its formidable armor-plated head. This bony exoskeleton acted as an impenetrable shield, providing protection against potential predators and reinforcing its role as a formidable predator. The head was adorned with a series of sharp bony plates, forming a terrifying set of jaws that were capable of delivering devastating bites. But what made Duncleosteus truly unique were its powerful jaws which were designed for swift and efficient feeding. Its mouth could open with incredible speed, creating a powerful suction force that allowed Duncleosteus to engulf prey in an instant. The jaws were equipped with sharp, blade-like bones, which functioned as a cutting mechanism, enabling Duncleosteus to slice through the toughest of prey with ease. The bony plates of Duncleosteus were not only a means of defense but also crucial for its survival. These plates, known as osteoderms, were embedded within the creature's skin, providing both flexibility and protection. The bony plates acted as a suit of armor, safeguarding Duncleosteus from attacks and minimizing the risk of injury during intense battles for dominance or prey. The remarkable defensive capabilities of Duncleosteus bony plates extended beyond mere protection. They also played a vital role in maintaining buoyancy. By utilizing the air-filled chambers within the plates, Duncleosteus could adjust its buoyancy and remain suspended in the water column with relative ease. This adaptation allowed it to navigate different depths and pursue prey with incredible agility. In the treacherous depths of the Devonian seas, Duncleosteus reigned as an apex predator, a true terror of the ancient waters. Its predatory nature and unparalleled hunting abilities established it as a top-level carnivore capable of taking down prey with ruthless efficiency. One of Duncleosteus' most remarkable hunting techniques was its ability to open its mouth with incredible speed, generating a powerful suction force. Imagine a vacuum cleaner of the deep, swiftly inhaling any unsuspecting prey within its reach. This unique adaptation allowed Duncleosteus to engulf its victims in an instant, ensuring a swift capture. 
Once Dunkley Osteus had secured its spray within its cavernous mouth, it utilized its sharp, bony plates to devastating effect. These blade-like plates acted as a cutting mechanism, enabling Dunkley Osteus to slice through flesh and crush bones with tremendous force. It possessed one of the most powerful bites of any known vertebrate, capable of exerting an astonishing amount of pressure. Dunkley Osteus bony plates were not only formidable weapons, but also served a crucial purpose during feeding. As it closed its jaws, the bony plates interlocked, forming a vice-like grip around its prey. This ensured that the struggling victim had no chance of escape, while simultaneously preventing any potential injuries to Dunkley Osteus itself. It's important to note that Dunkley Osteus was not a picky eater. Its diet encompassed a wide range of marine life, including other armored fishes, early sharks, and even smaller Dunkley Osteus individuals. With its massive size and insatiable appetite, Dunkley Osteus occupied the role of a dominant predator, reigning supreme in the food chain of its ancient marine ecosystem. Dunkley Osteus, with its awe-inspiring size and remarkable hunting abilities, possessed a suite of evolutionary adaptations that allowed it to thrive in the ancient Devonian seas. These adaptations were key to its success as a dominant predator and played a significant role in shaping its unique anatomy. However, despite its remarkable adaptations, Dunkley Osteus eventually faced its demise. The reasons behind its extinction are still a subject of scientific debate. One hypothesis suggests that environmental changes, such as alterations in water chemistry and declining oxygen levels, could have negatively impacted Dunkley Osteus and its prey. These changes may have disrupted the delicate balance of the Devonian ecosystem, leading to the decline and eventual extinction of this magnificent predator. Competition with other marine predators could also have played a role in the decline of Dunkley Osteus. As the Devonian seas witnessed the diversification of other formidable predators, Dunkley Osteus may have faced increased competition for resources and territory. The struggle for survival and limited availability of prey could have contributed to the eventual extinction of Dunkley Osteus. While the exact reasons for its extinction may remain elusive, Dunkley Osteus continues to leave a lasting legacy. Its presence in the fossil record serves as a testament to the incredible adaptations and evolutionary success achieved by prehistoric marine life. By studying Dunkley Osteus, scientists gain valuable insights into the dynamic nature of Earth's history and the intricate web of life that once thrived in our ancient oceans. The fossil record has gifted us with a window into the distant past, revealing the awe-inspiring existence of Dunkley Osteus. Let's explore some of the notable fossil discoveries that have shed light on this ancient titan and the invaluable scientific research surrounding its legacy. One remarkable Dunkley Osteus fossil discovery took place in the Cleveland Shale of Ohio, United States, in the late 19th century. These fossilized remains, unearthed by renowned paleontologist Edward Drinker Cope, provided the first insights into the extraordinary anatomy of Dunkley Osteus. Since then, additional Dunkley Osteus fossils have been found in various locations worldwide, including North America, Europe, and Africa. These fossil discoveries have played a crucial role in unraveling the mysteries surrounding Dunkley Osteus and the ecosystems of the late Devonian era. Thanks for watching, subscribe, and until next time.